Harrington, the Chief Executive Officer of the City of Wodonga. I want to take this opportunity um, to introduce to you some of our staff and the work they do for the community. And as part of your budget process, really encourage you to watch these videos and just get to know the incredible range of services that this council offers. Good morning, I'd like to introduce Steve. Um, Steve's uh, our infrastructure officer. He's actually been with council for over 40 years. So Steve has a lot of knowledge about how city, our city's been designed. Um, and Steve has also contributed a lot to our new city going forward. So Steve, what would your day consist of and what would your priorities be? I work in projects and design. We look after uh, uh, residential subdivisions in Wodonga. Uh, also look after new capital works projects, from roads to sporting fields to uh, road safety to public lighting, uh, environmental um, areas of uh, wetlands. So yeah, yeah. very diverse um, range of engineering projects we look after in the city to try and make the city both environmentally pleasant for the ratepayers and a safe environment for um, motorists and, and the general public, cyclists, or around, particularly around schools. Mm. Steve, would you say a big part of your job is problem solving? Because I know that a lot of people in our communities, uh, developers, people who are building, consultants, they, they will ring Steve just to find answers to what are sometimes difficult problems, but yeah. So a lot of our work um, is giving some of the new developments um, information before they start. Uh, private developers with um, commercial buildings want to know, you know where services are, uh, you know, are there going to be any implications in regard to traffic. So we generally get on the front foot with uh, our developers and give them that information so that they, uh, uh, they don't get any surprises. So what's 40 years been like working for the City of Wodonga? Very re rewarding. Uh, you know, when I started here, Beechworth Road was a single road. Norrose mm. Drive wasn't built. Population was probably 14,000. Um, you know, we were struggling town. Now, with the CBD redevelopment, you know, there's a lot more uh, activity. There's a lot more commercial development. You know, Wodonga has become, you know, again, very close to 40,000 people. Um, we have wonderful sporting facilities. Uh, great place to live.